at 10 o'clock tonight, potential clues in the murder case of 11-year-old Josue Flores. Detectives are roping off parts of the Salvation Army mission today near the scene of the murder. Channel 2 Samantha Potashkin joins us live from there tonight. Samantha, do we know what that evidence is yet? Well, Bill, right now detectives aren't saying exactly what kind of evidence they've collected, but we do know that this Salvation Army is only about a half a mile away from where the 11 year old was killed. We do have some video that we shot earlier today as detectives were here at the facility. Several people on the scene here as crime scene investigators were out here collecting evidence. The 11 year old was stabbed to death on his way home from school last month. Just yesterday, police released surveillance video of a man there calling a person of interest in the case. That man had on a green jacket with the letters L-Y-M-E-N with one letter obstructed. He was caught on surveillance running on North Main near Fulton just a few minutes after Josue was fatally stabbed. The little boy's family now hoping any of this new evidence will help bring whoever the killer is to justice. We hope to get to see him in court one day and if not, if justice doesn't get served here, it will be served with God. And earlier this week, Crime Stoppers increased the reward for any information leading up to an arrest in this case up to $45,000. We're told since then, several new tips have come in to investigators. Of course, if you have any information, you should call Houston Police or Crime Stoppers. Reporting live from North Houston, Samantha Batashkin, KPRC Channel 2 News.